guys, welcome back to Seashell Music. We've just seen a clip of Ed Sheeran's new song, so I thought I'd show you what's going on. Two chords all the way through. And in the video, he's got a capo on the second fret. Like I said, I haven't heard the whole song yet, so I don't know why he's got that there, but I'm sure we'll find out. We'll go to close up and I'll show you how to play it. Okay, so we have two chords in this song. First one, you bar the fourth fret, well, the second fret in relation to capo, and you play it in E minor shape just underneath. Which is a G sharp minor chord. Then the second chord, you bar the bottom five strings, and then you can mute the low E with your tip of your first finger, and then you play it an A minor seven chord underneath. Right. So the important thing in this song is the rhythm. It goes one, two, and three, and four, and two, and three, and four, and a bit slower. We go one, two, and three, and four, and two. And that's kind of one bar. So you got down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. And with the chord, it sounds like this. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. And that repeats four times on each chord. So you got C sharp minor seven chord. One, two, and three, and four. 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 And then you need to add in the, the little hammer ons and all the chucks. So what we've got, we've got. First thing he does, he plays the bar and then he hammers on that chord. So you play it without your E minor shape, and then you hammer it on. And then what you're doing, you're adding in chucks. So one. So the trick is to relax your hand and when it's this kind of funk rhythm guitar where your hands are constantly moving. And then he's playing the chord. So practice muting with this hand and doing a little chop and then adding the chord in. Same thing with this chord, you're playing the little bar and then you're hammering on your chord. And you can do your chucks anytime you want. So be a little bit creative with Okay, so that's what we've got of the song so far. With those two chords and your little funk rhythm. So the practice putting the chucks in and muting the chord and be a little bit creative with that and I'll see you all in the next lesson. If you like what I do, please subscribe and do a little thumbs up and all that. Cool. Catch you later.